this video we'll first define distribution, then we will cover measures of distribution, the mean, median, outliers, mode, minimum and maximum values, and quantiles. The most common method of analyzing a numeric variable is by exploring how the values are distributed. The distribution of a numeric variable shows all the possible values and how often they occur. A distribution provides methods in which many records of data can be summarized to provide basic information about the variable. These methods can either be numerical measures or visualizations. We'll explore the most popular methods using this data set of 10 rows of bank teller salary data. Because the sample data set is so small, we can make some quick observations about the salary variable. The lowest salary is $28,665. This is referred to as the minimum value. The highest salary is $44,020, the maximum value. Finally, many of the salaries are in the low $30,000 range. We'll begin by defining and calculating the salary variable's measures of distribution, mean, median, outliers, mode, minimum and maximum values, and quantiles. To find the mean or average, add up all the numbers and divide by the number of rows. $341,860 divided by 10 equals a mean of $34,186. To find the median, sort the numbers and find the middle value. If there are an odd number of rows, there is one middle value. If there are an even number of rows, there are two middle values, and the median will be the average of these two values. Here we sort the table by salary, then find the average of the two middle values by adding $33,980 to $34,850 and dividing by 2 to get $34,145. Values that fall outside of the normal range of the rest of the observations are called outliers. In our example, the value of $44,020 is an outlier from the rest of the values. The mode is the most commonly occurring value. In our sample data set, no values occur more than once, so there is no mode. As we've already noticed, the minimum and maximum values are $28,665 and $44,020. A quantile is a set of values that divide a frequency distribution into equal groups, each containing the same fraction of the total population. To find quantiles, divide the distribution into groups of equal size, with each group containing about the same number of rows. The most simple of quantiles has already been calculated. The median divides the records into two groups of five. The following quantiles are most often used. Tertiles, three groups. Quartiles, four groups. Quintiles, five groups. Deciles, 10 groups. And percentiles, 100 groups. Let's look at quartiles for our example. The median is commonly referred to as Q2, since it is the second quartile. Q1 and Q3 are also used often. To calculate quartile 1, we can look at the middle value of the first five records sorted in order, which is $31,300, and then look at the middle value of the last five records for quartile 3, which is $35,100. These values, along with our median, are our quartile values. This concludes our video on measures of distribution. Today, we define distribution, and then we discuss the measures of distribution, including mean, median, outliers, mode, minimum and maximum values, and quantiles.